Hello Hacktubers, in today's video we gonna make two projects. One of them is Rain Detector. And the second one is Earthquake Sensor Alarm. Before I start showing how to make these gadgets, take a moment and please subscribe and after watching this video, visit my channel page for more videos. For making the rain sensor, you will need electronic parts like this transistor, Darlington N-Pen transistor BC517, ordinary LED and an resistor, 10 kilo ohms, a buzzer, battery holder and batteries. First we gonna connect the positive wire from buzzer and resistor to positive wire of battery holder. The transistor pinout is collector base emitter. On emitter we gonna solder the negative wire from battery holder. On collector we gonna solder the negative wire from the buzzer. Before we proceed to next step, check the circuit that is working. By touching the resistor and transistor base, the electric circuit is finished. Now we're gonna make the sensor and you're gonna need solid copper wire, plastic transparent piece, As you can see, the contact sensor for rain is finished and it's made from two copper wires who don't touch each other. Now, on the resistor and on base of transistor, we're gonna solder the wires to the sensor. The rain sensor is finished and now we're gonna test it. For making this simple and basic earthquake alarm sensor, you will need two AAA batteries that give 3 volts, a push switch, transistor BC517, one 100 kilo ohm resistor, metal bolt, piezo and glass jar and one LED.
First we're gonna connect LED with the piezo. Positive with positive, negative with negative terminal. Just to remind you, this is the transistor BC517 and this is the collector, base, emitter. Collector we're gonna solder to the negative terminal of piezo and LED. On transistor base we're gonna solder the 100 kilohm resistor. Also, the push switch and the capacitor we are going to connect in parallel connection. The negative terminal for capacitor we are going to solder to the emitter and other on the resistor. The sensor wires we are going to solder on positive wires from piezo and LED and other on 100 ohms resistor. Now the wires from the battery we are going to solder the positive here and the negative here. On the lid I have glued everything, the sensor, the batteries and the circuit and here it is the reset switch and now we're gonna test it. The motion sensor is very simple, if he detects any motion, sound alarm will activate. 